This new plugin from Traction is amazing. Dan Dean Essential Bass. Love it. Check this out. Best thing to do, best way to really test it out, is to make a track. And so I'll show you line by line what I did to make this track. So first of all, I made a bass line. There's a bit of distortion on the bass there. Drums. FM synth. going on here. I've got FX level. So this, these are the presets first of all. So you get all of these different presets. Finger fretless frets, pick, pop, slap, acoustic ambience, chorus, etc. Electric, dandy and bass. So the very basic bass ones are there. Ones with effects on them are there. Or you can just slide down through them all like that. And then you've got the main stuff here, so you've got. Uh, let's get down. So it's a low E. This one has some distortion on it because here's the effects section and you can turn them on and off as simple as that. That's light distortion. You can get all kinds on there. That's too much in it. Chorus. That's just there subtly to kind of expand it. Bring it a little bit wider. Might cause phase issues though when you do that, but it sounds nice for now. Phaser, compressor. Now you can choose any of these here in any of those positions. So it's nice. And EQ. You can set glide, so. You can have it on legato, so. So it only plays, it only slides when you have one key still down, when you press the other key. You can set the amount of voices. You can tune it. Anywhere from 400 to 500. If you're playing in E and you want to make it a bit easier for yourself on a keyboard, if you want to play your keyboard in the key of C, yeah, you go up to the following C, the next C above, 
and hit this down, down eight semitones. That's the key of E. Oh no, no, wait, no, it's at the piano. Now there's a couple of tricks there. The reason why you can't use the lower C is because when you hold down the lower C, C sharp, D, and maybe E flat does tricks. So hold down C and play a high G. Uh, holding down C sharp. C. So that's um, both holding the that's holding C, playing a G. Holding C sharp, playing a G. Holding D, playing a G. Same G. Holding E flat. And then your FX level, so you can go from full on to whatever amount you want in between. So like I said, go in here, you can get all of these different types. Distortion, electric, phaser, acoustic, what's the acoustic ones like? Oh yeah, they're quite nice. You get that fret buzz when you hit it hard. Also, when you um, push up on the slider, what's it called? Modulation wheel. Keeps you harmonic. Quite nice, isn't it? The beautiful looking instruments on here. Slap. Very nice sound. Not sure I've actually seen one of these Telecaster basses before. It's a nice sound, though, isn't it? I like that there's some unusual basses in here. Mike Lull I haven't come across. I mean, maybe he's a really famous bass maker. I'm a guitarist. Washburns as well. I always like the Washburns. It's kind of a short neck. It feels more comfortable as a guitarist to play. But they also have a different sound. Um, I've been really enjoying it. So, if you want to buy it, I'll leave a link in the description down below. If you buy something through the link, any of the traction stuff, then I'll get some percentage of that sale and um, it'll help my channel a lot. Fantastic.